here on the campus of San Diego State University at the press release party for the food vendors at the new San Diego Aztec Stadium. Here with Sean Walchef of Cali Barbecue. Uh, Sean, tell us about the brand. What's up, Howard? It's so weird to be on, on this end of uh, the interview. Usually I'm the one asking all the questions, but yeah, we couldn't be more excited to be a part of this Aztec Stadium. Um, as somebody that grew up in San Diego and somebody that absolutely loves sports, loves the Aztecs, loves the Chargers, loves the Padres, anything that happens in sports entertainment, we wanna be a part of it. And this is the most important thing that's happening in San Diego. And uh, if you wanna come a little bit closer, I wanna show you exactly where our stand is gonna be. Where is it, Howard? It's right. Isn't it right here, right at the entrance? Right. I'm just kidding. I have no idea where it's going to be. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, there's going to be Cali barbecue, Cali wings, and we're going to be a part with so many of these other great hospitality partners. I mean, these are brands that I grew up admiring, grew up loving. And the fact that now we're friends in this hospitality circle, it's really exciting. What do you think, Howard? Well, I think that all the food vendors that are here, um, we all share the same passion for San Diego. Yep. Um, we all share the same passion for our food product. Uh, we're, we're, we're passionate about San Diego Aztec, uh, San Diego State University and the Aztec. So I think we're all great partners and the food, the food experience is gonna be phenomenal as well as the on-field experience too. Yeah, I think one of the most exciting things, I mean, we host a podcast called Digital Hospitality and what we love about this new stadium experience is what is it gonna look like? How is it gonna feel? And how do we get incredibly slow smoke barbecue to someone in their seats so that they're not missing the game? You know, we don't want people waiting in long lines like you typically do for barbecue. We want to get barbecue to your seats. We want to get taco to your seats. We want to get incredible hamburgers to your seats. And we're really excited to work with uh, the Aztecs to, to make that happen. Yep. So what food items are we going to serving in the stadium, you think? Uh, we're definitely going to be doing Cali Wings, which is one of our virtual brands. Uh, we're really excited about that. We've got a lot of different flavors that we tried out. We just did a video with Jay Cation TV, which is a YouTuber. He did an incredible taste test. He went down to our Barrio Logan location and did this taste test. I got to try wings that I've never even had, which apparently are on our menu and they are phenomenal. And we'll definitely be serving them in the stadium. But I don't know, what about the barbecue side? Barbecue side, I think we're gonna definitely do some uh, pork ribs and we'll do our brisket. Yep. Uh, for sure. Uh, get a couple sandwiches in there as well. And gotta do fries. Gotta do fries. And, I, and one of the coolest things is doing it on social. So whatever we're gonna do, we're gonna pull the fans, figure out what do they want. And if we can make it happen, slow food fast. That's what we're gonna slow do. Slow food fast. You mentioned the virtual brand, right? Yes. So tell us how many stores you have in San Diego and what's the growth? So we have, we are opening up our second store, our second virtual ghost kitchen. We call them a friendly ghost kitchen because we share the story, but that's gonna be opening in the beginning of 2022, right up here near campus off of College Avenue. Um, that is at the Aztec Food Hub. Uh, the other brand we have at Barrio Logan is the Barrio Food Hub. And then we've got our original location in Spring Valley. I'm Shane Harden, I'm from Hodads. My grandparents started it in 1969. We've been uh, doing the same thing for a long time and we're in Petco Park, so it was kind of a logical move to do this here. What gets you most excited about being in the new Aztec Stadium? It's awesome. It's just a whole new opportunity, new uh, new stuff to watch. We got the foosball. We got the uh, hopefully some concerts, and yes. I, it's just awesome to be in a in a brand new thing right off the bat. We uh, we've never done it before. We're gonna be doing burgers, fries, onion rings, mayo, mustard, onions, ketchup, pickles, tomatoes, lettuce, sesame seed bun. Fantastic. talking with Mike from the taco stand. Mike, how you doing? Doing well. Tell us more about the taco stand. We've been around a uh, local San Diego brand in La Jolla since 2013. We do tacos best. It's the city of tacos and we like to try and keep them as authentic as possible. We're super excited to be partnering with uh, SDSU going into the stadium. It's going to be fun. So what got you most excited about joining the project? You know, the, the fact that they're really focusing on all the local concepts rather than you know, some of the other stadiums where you're only seeing the big brands, it was fun for them to invite all the smaller guys who really represent San Diego. Which tacos are you gonna be serving in the stadium? Uh, it's gonna be carne asada, pastor, pollo, camarón, and mushroom. And what's your favorite taco? Al pastor, any day of the week. The flavor is gonna wake you up in the middle of the night, craving to go get one.
here with Dan from the iconic San Diego brand, the Crack Shack. Dan, tell us a little about the brand. We are just a fun chicken spot out of San Diego, really specializing in fried chicken sandwiches, bone-in fried chicken fries, salads, uh, featuring jidori and uh, local veggies, so. Why San Diego Aztec Stadium? We think that this is gonna be an iconic project in San Diego, and we wanted to help get the ball rolling with some great food. So great. It was an easy decision for us. Good, good. And just what our whistle a little bit, what's gonna be on the menu at the Aztec Stadium? Yeah, I mean, uh, more the same. I think that we're gonna be specializing in fried chicken sandwiches, fries. We're gonna keep it simple and, and delicious for everybody. So you might see the Coopville, you might see the Firebird, maybe a new basic chick or maybe a special sandwich when we get out there. This is Megan from Batch and Box. Uh, Megan, tell us about your brand. Well, we opened about a year ago in the Del Mar Highlands Town Center in Del Mar and we're total rookies. We feel like we are Cinderella going to the ball here as we join Aztec Stadium and the partners here, and we're so thrilled to be here. I'm the founder and owner and also cookie creator. I have absolutely no formal training in baking, but I just am a fanatic about cookies. We signed our lease to our shop 10 days before COVID rolled out. Oh, wow. So it was pretty scary, but we, we really thought that people would want our cookies. We had a model that was COVID ready. It was curbside pickup, grab and go and shipping. So we thought we would take the leap of faith and open last October 24th of 2020. And we did it and it turned out great. We've been flying. We will be serving six cookies at the stadium. That will include our classic, which is our number one seller. It's a classic chocolate chip. Everyone loves it. The doodle, which is our spin on a snickerdoodle. It has warm cinnamon chips in it. We also have the Coco PB. It's a dark chocolate, very decadent chocolate cookie with peanut butter chips. We also have a sugar that's our number two seller with black and red sprinkles to kind of support the Aztec theme. And then Aztec Stadium's also asked us to come up with a chili chocolate that will be a specific Aztec cookie. We also will be serving a gluten-friendly chocolate chip. Fantastic. And you can only get that Aztec cookie at the stadium? Correct. Fantastic. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Here at San Diego State University, talking with Joey from Best Pizza and Brew. Uh, Joey, tell us about your brand. We've been around for about eight years now. We've got five locations in San Diego. We serve pizza, salads, sandwiches, a ton of craft beer and we're really excited to be part of the new stadium. So what pizzas are you gonna be serving at the stadium? Uh, at the stadium, we're gonna have the best white pizza. That's right here. It's got caramelized onions, uh, roasted garlic, spinach, ricotta cheese. We have the buffalo chicken pizza. Oh my uh, gosh. It looks okay. I made that myself. I haven't made a pizza in about a year. So that was, uh, I somehow pulled You shake that off that COVID rust? Yeah, no, so somehow. Buffalo chicken. Oh, Man, this dirty. looks just That's delicious. So tell us more about your brand, Joe. I started 17 years ago. My two brothers couldn't find a good cheesesteak in San Diego. Uh, we're gonna serve our famous cheesesteaks, probably a combination of our most popular ones. The classic steak onions and cheese, maybe cheese whiz, maybe mushroom cheesesteaks, and of course, the garlic fries. We talked to all the food vendors today. We couldn't leave without talking to one last vendor, which is Todd from the San Diego Aztec shop. Uh, Todd is the CEO, so tell us about your involvement with the stadium. Well, Aztec Shops, which runs all the dining on the campus of San Diego State University, is, is uh, running all the food and beverage at the stadium. Um, and Susan Hawk, who's our general manager at the stadium, um, you know, brought all of our great partners in to be a part of that experience. And Cali Barbecue is one of those strong, fantastic brands in San Diego. Thank you. And we're just so excited to have you as part of the, part of the experience great. and part of the team. Well, here we are at the finale of the press release of the new San Diego Aztec Stadium, here with the Executive General Manager of Food and Beverage, Susan. So tell us the process of selecting all of these great food vendors. We looked at local San Diego brands and we wanted to get the best brands in every category of what we would call stadium food. And that's how, how we really did it. And then we went out and we talked to them about the project and, and luckily everybody was interested, but we tried to find the best and something that would resonate with the fans. Every owner that we talked to today from every brand including Cali Barbecue ourselves. We are so grateful for the invite. Um, can't tell you how excited we are for the opening of the stadium. And so when is that gonna happen? 
Um, opening day is September 3rd, 2022. The, the San Diego State Aztecs will be playing the University of Arizona. September 3rd, be there. We'll see ya.